the MIT Portugal program has made an important contribution bridging that gap between academia and companies and many uh, innovative ideas are now being explored under the program. It is extremely well structured, it has great faculty, it's completely different from the traditional doctoral program and the traditional scope uh, of research. Understand that the, that the technology has much more to it. You have to, to bring the, these two things together, so the science and the application in the market. I think the, this culture of science and entrepreneurship is expanding in Portugal right now and uh, all this community that is derived from, from it maximizes the success of the PhD programs, of the technologies that are developed. Our graduates have gone on to be involved in startups and established companies, some of them are going forward in academia. Many remain in Portugal and others create an international network. They are becoming entrepreneurs. Entrepreneurs not only creating companies, but seeking for different types of jobs, looking directly into the industry for new opportunities, creating their own companies. So the main aspect is really this uh, MIT genetic code. So it shaped, I think, uh, the way I work and even the ways I, I see uh, my, my position in life, let's say. At MIT we've received several requests from other governments, several requests from other institutions who are specifically looking for something like the MIT Portugal program because it has gained this reputation as a successful way of doing these things. This is not easy. It requires a lot of work, and MIT Portugal means work. Work, work, work more, work harder, work with everyone. So the fact that there were joint programs uh, were very catalyzed by the American universities. They put the Portuguese universities working together, which is something that for us rectors is sometimes not as easy to do. So as a whole, I think this is something that will be very vital for Portugal in the next years to come. We can leverage some of the things that we've accomplished so far, and once we do that, then we have sources of funding for the students, we have um, more resources for innovation. Uh, I think it's a snowball effect, that as you start down the hill, and it grows and grows and grows at a rapid rate. Above all, these programs have become a seed towards new networks of opportunities at a global scale. I hope that it can continue to foster prosperity for Portugal.